Hello everyone, this is Mark with MHDAlerts.com. It's day of September 15, 2013. This is an update for Hurricane Ingrid and take a look at it on Google Earth right now with the updated spaghetti model path as you see here. And it uh, looks like there's only a few spaghetti model paths that may take it into Texas, but I think that uh, that's definitely not going to happen. According to the National Hurricane Center, we'll make landfall as a hurricane and it's going to be category one. Currently there are hurricane warnings and watches that are currently posted. I'll go over that information with you right now. And first I'm actually going to bring up the path of the storm on the National Hurricane Center. As you see there is a small cone of uncertainty now so definitely know that this hurricane will make landfall in this area right here. And I'll bring you that information right now. According to the National Hurricane Center, a hurricane warning is in effect for Cabo Rojo to La Pesca and a hurricane watch is in effect for north of La Pesca to Bahia Algodines, and I'm sorry if I mispronounced that. I'll post that in the link in the description of the video below, and uh, also post the information on the MHTLarch.com site. Here is a real quick look at another radar that I found that I think is actually a pretty good radar for both storms. We're looking at both Ingrid and Manuel. Manuel, and Manuel is actually going to actually affect a lot of area of Mexico with the heavy rain and thunderstorms. So I'll keep watch on that for you over the next couple of days. So once again, folks, don't forget to uh, check out the Facebook page at facebook.com slash Tracker. I'll continue to update you on the latest information. I'm also going to update you on the hurricane or typhoon that's headed towards Japan, which could be a very bad uh, deal for them as far as the uh, situation goes with Fukushima. So stay alert for that. Once again, folks, thanks for watching. Stay alert, be cool, and have a nice day.